so welcome back again to another video in today's video we're gonna look at lift gamma and gain so uh, basically uh, lift gamma and gain affects the uh, luminance of an image now what does it means it means the luminance is the ability of emitting the light so any part that is brighter or darker uh, lift gamma and gain affecting those areas so for simplicity let's look at this um um, RGB curve here in this photo editor here so here we go this photo here you can see this uh, lighted part which uh, become more clear brighter and the darker part of the shadow part of the image is uh, and then in between is the mid-tone so let's uh, let's just imagine that this is this part is the um, lift and this part is the gain and this part is the gamma so let's do that and see so again lift controls the shadow moving from black to white so you can see the shadows around here when we move this little bit up you can see it tries to remove the shadow applying to uh, highlighting it more making more uh, brighter and then if we move from here to here it turns in opposite okay so let's go to this part here which which said it's um represent the gain so the gain again controls the highlights so if we go here you can see adding more highlights to it more highlights to it and as we go to the opposite direction it's adding less highlights to the image and then in the middle as we said it uh, represents the gamma which controls the mid-tones and so let's just bring this one up you can see trying to contrast the image with the black and white or the brightest part of the image and the darkest part of the image so if we move this little bit back here we're making the image more contrast here and then if we move this one out here we're making it more highlighted we're highlighting it so with that uh, let's jump to Kden Live and see how we can apply the same idea to lift gamma and gain so here in Kden Live again uh, we have this uh, clip here which I have created this gradient black and white clip so you can see this is the uh, highlighted part of the clip and this is the mid-tone the mid-tone is where the white going towards the black and the black towards the white uh, in between is the mid-tone and the darker part of the clip is this one here which is totally black so let's apply the lift gamma and gain and see what happens so with the idea of the RGB curve in the photo editor we have learned that uh, moving up from here is the image become more white or brighter and moving down here the image become darker so let's try to do that in lift as lift controls the shadow so here's the black part controls the shadow here so if we click here you can see that everything becomes white just like in the curve and as we go back here it becomes normal again so again lift controls the shadow moving from black to white and then the gain as we have said the gain controls the highlights so this is the highlights part so when we lift it up the highlights trying to push into the dark part of the image so you can see here once we click somewhere here you can see this uh, highlight try to push the black part out and then we are left with this darker part here and then this is between the mid tones here so this is where the um, gamma comes in to control this to push more a little bit up or towards the brightest part so if we move this up here you can see trying the gamma trying to move uh, the, the mid tones all the way in and if we move back you can see trying to push it back towards the uh, brightest part of the image so again lift controls the shadows gamma controls the um, mid tones the trying to contrast the image and then the gain controls the highlights so let's go to a little video clip that i have here and see how this works so here we got this video clip here so let's apply lift gamma and gain to it to see how it works so let's click that and apply to our clip so again here uh, you can see some dark part of the images around here and then the on this big area we have the brightest part of the image to highlight part of the image and the darker part of or the shadow part of the image so again with the lift if we move up here you can see that it's trying to uh, remove the shadow trying to uh, control the shadow part of the image and make it a little bit more uh, highlighted or brighter and then if we go to the gain again gain controls the highlights so if we go up here you can see more 
uh, trying to highlight more in the darker part of the image as we move up and then as we move down you can see it's become more uh, darker so let's just put it somewhere here so this is before and this is after and then again the gamma as we said controls the midtones or the contrast so the more we move up here uh, it's moving towards the white part of the image and the more we move down here it's moving towards the black part of the image so if we move up everything becomes so white and if we move down uh, we're trying to control the contrast so you can see somewhere there so you can see this is before and this is after much better okay so um you can apply this idea uh, using lift gamma and gain lift control shadows um, gamma controls the midtones the contrast and then um, gain controls the highlights so once you're happy with that you can uh, apply a kind of feeling to the uh, image so here we have the image that is um, kind of hot so we need to make it a little bit cooler so you go you can use this color wheel here to do that okay so that's how we can use the basic ideas um, how to use um, lift gamma and gain thank you for watching and uh, see you back again in another video